hello guys uh, in this tutorial uh, we'll see uh, how we can use a beaver builder and we can create a, a website using beaver builder default template so in that case you need three things first one uh, is a beaver builder theme one and the child theme both and and the plugin called uh, beaver builder agency plugin okay you can see beaver builder plugin agency version so these three things needed to create a website using beaver builder so as we already installed uh, beaver builder three plugins like beaver builder theme and child theme and uh, bb agency plugin right so once you install all of these things you can see you can go to your home page or about us page whatever okay and then you can add your template so you can see as I logged in so at the top bar you can see the option called beaver builder so just click on here first so once you click on you can see it's a front-end editor so as a default you can see uh, this template is already installed for me actually but if you need if you would like to change this template and you can uh, or you would like to use uh, another template you can so just click on plus symbol first okay and go to the templates so once you click on templates you can see the landing pages okay so these are the landing pages for default beaver builder suppose you would like to use this theme okay and uh, whatever you need so as of now i'm just selecting this one so once you selecting this one you can see this kind of pop-up replace existing layout append new layout and cancel so we'll use replace existing layout as because uh, the old layout layout we need to replace so we'll click uh, replace existing layout so just click on here and just okay now we can see the template we would like to use it's or uh, it's installed right so once you're done you can see uh, just once you're done just click on done and then publish so now you can see our home page is ready to go right we can change the slider as well we can change this text as well we can change the images and this is and this is the testimonials we can change we can add more social media icons as well so here you can see the home page suppose you would like to add another ribbon so how you can add so just click on beaver builder option again and once you click on beaver builder option just click on plus symbol and you can see these are the templates so we don't need templates we need a ribbon first so just column you can just go to the column section and then click on uh, pre-built rows so once you click on pre-built rows you can see these kind of things right suppose you would like to add a, a pricing table in this section so how you can add that add this just click on pricing tables once you click on pricing tables you can see these are the demo i mean the templates so suppose you would like to use this one okay so just drag and drop over there like this so now you can see our price section has been appeared we can change this price section as per one need so one two three box you can see one two three box so once you click on the first one box edit pricing box you can change everything right so this this is our first box you can change the title as well okay like this i just added then you can change the price option here you can see price suppose you would like to add 25 okay then you can slash month you can change this as well features features you can see okay 5gb storage 
price price features to description 500 users you can see this this and this and after that you can add more features okay something like this okay you can add to two months like this okay you can see the new one is added two months and then after that submit I mean the save changes okay so also general styles okay column height should be equalized so that it should be aligned now you can see okay it should be aligned actually no problem uh, can add a custom CSS so like this we can easily add more features and etc okay so save the changes so now I just save the changes then done and publish so once you publish you can just rephrase you can see it it automatically rephrased and you can see that your price section has been appeared over there okay oh actually this is the design layout first this this and this okay it's not aligned you see it's a design okay so that's it we'll discuss more about beaver builder in our next tutorial thank you